good morning welcome back to our social class in the previous class we have completed our lesson number 70 how we communicate textual exercises and also the new words in the syllabus now we should start writing off answer the following means question and answer students in yesterday's class we have completed lesson number 17 how we communicate textual exercises and also cw part new words completed okay 30 new words i have given everybody completed ma now everybody come to the next page and uh, mention today's date and day and also mention answer the following leave one line come to the next line question number 1 shall i read yeah neatly how i am sending the pic please uh, like that you have to write down in your CWs neatly you have pre do your work okay ma neat presentation I want okay when you are coming to the classes in the after uh, this week eight and words are you coming to school no that time I will check your notes then if your handwriting is very bad bad in condition okay I won't accept isn't it clear children please write with neat handwriting okay first question how did early humans communicate how they communicated yes through the signs and sounds already explained in the lesson no early man early humans used signs and sounds to communicate sign spelling s i g n s signs and sounds s o u n d s sounds to communicate everybody memorize this spelling communicate c o m m u n i c a t e communicate okay second point in that some of them draw on cave walls cave walls to express e x p r e s s express their feelings okay uh, after this answer coming to the second question okay children uh, some are uh, did not learn the cursive handwriting some new students are there i think yeah you have to practice and you should write try to write in the cursive handwriting okay namma next one what is the difference between personal communication personal and the mass communication what are the differences between this personal communication and mass communication uh, the first point is first personal communication what is personal communication information or a messages information or a messages is delivered to a person or a few people okay an information or any messages is delivered to a one person or a few people that is known as personal communication for example telephone through the telephone we are communicating with our relatives okay and also one person also we are talking all the uh, group of people also we are talking in that okay the second one is mass communication what is the second point mass communication information or a message is information or a message is delivered to a large number of people at a time we should deliver a large number of people that message or information that is known as mass communication uh, okay in this what is the example yes best example newspapers n e w s p a p e r s okay newspapers are the best example for this mass communication okay children here personal spelling p e r s o n a l personal communication all right said no next information i n f o r m a t i o n information okay message m e s s a g e message delivered d e l i v e r e d delivered person p e r s o n person next telephone t e l e t e l e p h o n e phone mass m a s s mass communication information i n f o r m a t i o n information or a message m e s s a g e message delivered again this word d e l i v e r e d delivered to a large l a r g e large number n u m b e r number of people p u o p l okay newspapers are the best example for this okay children today only you have to complete these two answers one and two you have to complete in your cw neatly with your neat handwriting okay how i am presenting in the cw same like that you should present in your cw okay children remaining question and answers and also the activity i will give by tomorrow okay tomorrow for i day no last day also no tomorrow i will give the no remaining notes okay children um, please complete this in your cw thank you bye bye